Assalamu alaikum students so hope you all will be fine Today the topic we are going to study is named as natural resources natural resources As the name is indicating natural is something that has been created by the nature Allah the almighty without the human help So as the natural resources are things that grow or are created naturally without human help these are the resources that cannot be created by the humans these are all that grow or created by naturally the word resource means something that can be used only natural things that are useful to humans can be called the natural resources all the things that are useful to humans are named as natural resources here you can see a number of examples of natural resources that are useful for the survival of living things Here are some examples of natural resources. Number 1 water. As I told you in yesterday's lecture as well that water is one of the most essential natural resource for all the living species. If it's in pond or in river or in uh, ocean it's useful or it's a habitat for many living objects. it humans also use it to drink water to wash clothes to wash dishes as a transport either to cover the long distances or short distances in short water is very essential component for humans and other living objects survival number second trees and plants trees and plants are also very important for the living things survival as the humans get oxygen from the plants and in return they give them carbon dioxide which is important for their survival as well other examples include the oil gas that we use um for cooking foods coal that is also used to generate the electricity gold silver sand salt wind energy and solar energy energy that we get from the sun is named as solar energy so these are some of the examples of natural resources here we will see how humans use the natural resources what are some of the ways in which these natural resources can be used So humans use natural resources for all sorts of reasons. Number 1 trees and plants. Humans use trees and other plants for five main reasons. For buildings as human cut down trees to make their houses or buildings. Number 2 food. We get also food from the trees and plants medicines many plants are used to make the medicines clothing how trees and plants are used to make clothing maybe many of you is familiar with a fabric used in clothing called the viscose that is also known as rayon so that fiber is made almost entirely from the trees so yes trees and plants also help to in clothing and for decoration for make something to crafts uh, and uh, other uh, for creativity purposes as well the next one natural resource water humans use water for three main reasons for drinking for washing and transport 
to cover the distances either short distances or to cover the long distances also human in other uh, um, in other second reasons humans use water as for fun minerals humans use minerals for four main reasons human use re, uh, minerals for building for the growing plants energy source as i told you um, we can generate energy and coal is the source to generate this and for decoration purposes as we make jewelry from the gold and silver so these are uh, some natural resources with their uses and their uh, with main reasons as we have talked about uh, the resources we can divide the resources into two categories renewable renewable and non renewable resources all the natural resources can be divided into these two categories now first see what are the renewable resources renewable resources are resources that will not run out humans can keep using them as much as they like let's see some examples of renewable resources that humans if they keep using them they will not run out and will still there for their future generations for example wind and energy from the sun wind is something that is renewable resource if we consume air this is something that will not run out and energy from the sun sun is the major or the central source of heat and light so it's an example of renewable resource when used as energy resources the earth will not run out of wind or energy from the sun trees are also renewable resources because forests are able to regrow but that does not mean to cut down the trees and uh, that will lead towards the deforestation in which the human cut down the trees for their fun activities for just creating buildings or unnecessary purposes next one non renewable resources now what are the non renewable resources these are the resources that can only be used once once they have all been used up there are no more of them so the examples of non renewable resources are coal as we can use coal for generating electricity so it's a non renewable resource once human use them and keep using them there will a time came when there will be no coal left behind so the coal oil and other minerals are non renewable resources if humans continue to use them the one day the earth will run out of them so this is the main difference between the renewable that can be reused and that can regrow but the non renewable resources are resources that can be used once now bear in mind the concept of natural resource come to page number 21 of your science workbook do you remember what a natural resource is yes we know natural resource is a resource that has been created by naturally without human help natural resources are things that grow or are created naturally without human help below are a number of objects tick the ones that are natural resources and put a cross through the ones that are not natural resources here you can see a picture a uh, number of objects this includes both the natural resources and some that have been created by humans 
So let's see one by one. As its obvious one, trees. Trees is something as we studied, these are the natural resources. This is the object that has not been created with the human help but naturally. So tree is a natural resource. Is TV a natural resource? No, this is something that has been invented. So it's created with the human help. It's not a natural resource. Similarly, an electric appliance um, for used for educational purposes, laptop is not a natural resource. So put a cross. Here is a picture of a stream. Water flowing from the height, coming from the mountains and making a stream. This is something that has been created without human help and naturally so it's a natural resource. Car is something that is not created naturally but with a human help so we will put a cross in it. Next is a picture of a wheelbarrow. This is something that has been created by the humans to facilitate themselves. So it's not been created naturally. Here is a picture of a key. It's definitely not created naturally. This is a picture of oil coming out of the earth. Oil is, oil is a natural resource. So you will put tick here. Coal is also a mineral and a natural resource that is used to generate the electricity so you will put tick here as well last one is a picture of a football this is something that has been created by the humans not naturally so you will put a cross here now come to the page number 22 the next page what is it for question number one is saying column one shows five natural resources gold fish coal tree and oil column 2 shows how each may be used house car light bulb plate and a girl draw a line from each natural resource to its use the clues below will help one natural resource that can be worn by a person if it's a gold this is something that can be worn by the human so you will match the gold with the girl the next one one natural resource belongs on a plate here you can see a picture of a fish so there is a picture of a fish if, if uh, you will draw fish out of the water for the food purposes so you will uh, fry the fish and will serve yourself or others in a plate so you will match fish with a plate next one one natural resource can be used to build a house if you say this natural resource, you can easily find out what natural resource can be used to make a house or building. So, as we know that the wood of a tree is used to make houses. So, you will match tree with a house. Next one, one natural resource makes the car go. We know that the car works with a chemical known as petrol and that petrol is in the form of oil so you will match the oil with the picture of car last one one natural resource can create electricity the left natural resource is a coal and we all know that coal is used to generate the electricity so we will match the coal with the, with, uh, with the light bulb now here is another activity number two natural resource crossword a crossword is given all you have to do is to fill it with different numbers 
some are horizontal and some are vertical here the clues are given down and across across means you have to complete the sentences or to find the answers of them and then you will write them accordingly within their respective boxes and numbers for as in across the first given number is 4 resources that will not run out as we have studied the two kinds of natural resources renewable and non-renewable the resources that will not run out are known as renewable so we will find number four here and across mean horizontally so we will uh, we will write renewable here the next one dash can be used to make electricity but it's non-renewable it means that they are talking about a mineral that is non-renewable but is used to generate the electricity then definitely it's a coal so we will find number six here and we will write coal here number eight the type of energy that comes from the sun the energy that we get from the sun is known as solar energy we will find number eight here horizontally here and we will write solar s o l a r solar now come towards the down clues number one non-renewable resource found deep in the ground all the non-renewable resources for example oil and other ones that found deep in the ground are known as minerals you will find number one here and you have to write the answer vertically the answer is minerals number two natural resources are only those things that are dashed to humans all the natural resources are the things that are beneficial or useful to humans so we will write useful here number two vertically and downwards we will write useful number three a natural resource used to build furniture and houses we have studied that trees are used to build buildings or houses so in number three you will write trees the next one dash is an example of a natural resource which is used to make jewelry and the resource that is used to make jewelry is known as gold so you will write gold in number five here the last one a natural resource that we need for drinking washing and transport so we use water a resource that is used for drinking washing and transport is water we will write w a t e r water here